He's one of the ba greatest baseball players in history. Jackie Robinson changed the game in more ways than one, and he was an idol for thousands of kids in the 40s and 50s. One of them, a kid from Wisconsin, and in a twist of fate, Robinson befriended that young man, and now his story is immortalized for generations to come in a new children's book. Ron, Ron Rabinowitz is the author of Always Jackie. And this all stems from a meeting you had with him when you were a boy, is that right? That's correct. My dad wrote him a letter when I, I grew up in Sheboygan, Wisconsin. My father wrote him a letter and told him how much I admired him. And he didn't want to tell me that he wrote to him because he didn't want me disappointed in case he didn't respond. <laughs> and he did respond. And he said, next time the clubs in Milwaukee playing the Braves, he would love to meet me. At that time, the Atlanta Braves were the Milwaukee Braves. So we went to a Dodger Brave game and after the game, wait, waited for him to come out of the locker room. And I ran up to him with about 50 other kids who were looking for autographs. And I said, uh, Jackie, I'm Ronnie Rabinovich. Do you remember me? He said, sure I do. And my dad was standing over my shoulder. He said, sure, Jackie, with the thousands of letters you get, how would you remember? He says, no, I remember your dad wrote me on lawyer stationery. My <laughs> father was an attorney. And Jackie said, stay in touch. So I wrote him a letter. Jackie Robinson, Stanford, Connecticut. No address, no zip code. He got it. He'd write Ronnie Rabinovich, Sheboygan, Wisconsin. No address, no zip code. I'd get it. <laughs> that first meeting had such an impact on you. What, what was it like when you met him? And, and why did it stick with you so much? That it, that it stayed with you through your whole life? Well, you know, at first I loved him just because he was helping my Dodgers win pennants. But as I got older, I realized how much more than just baseball he was, mm -hmm. how he changed this world, uh, and he did it alone. I mean, they say that Babe Ruth changed baseball. Jackie Robinson changed America. There's some very real kind of, I guess, adult issues going on in his life and what he went through. How did you make that uh, into a book for kids? I mean, do you try to, to kind of hide some things or do you tell him the real truth of the things he went through? I, I tell him the real truth of what, what he went through. And I think it's important for all everybody to realize and know. Uh, and with kids, I also talk about bullying. And certainly Jackie was bullied a lot. Ron, what do you hope kids and, and frankly, parents uh, get from this book when they sit down and they read it either with their kids or, or, or alone? Well, a better understanding about Jackie uh, and understanding about the friendship that I had with him. Uh, it, we were so different. And yet, you know, I was white. He was black. I was Jewish. He was Christian. I was a kid. He was an adult. I was from a little town in the Midwest and he was from a big city out East. And yet there was this bond of friendship and love. And uh, it was just amazing. He was a, a real classic guy. He was a real hero. He never smoked, he never drank, he never took drugs, and he never refused to sign a kid's autograph. Yeah. It's amazing. What was it about you that he liked so much to make sure that the correspondence stayed up? You know, I, I've been asked that question many, many times, and I'm not sure. He felt comfortable with us. Uh, he loved being with my family, my dad and my mom and my sister and I. And I would write to him, and he felt compelled, I guess, to write back to me. Uh, he was at my 10th birthday party singing <laughs> happy birthday to me. Can you imagine this? Oh. I mean, it was the greatest birthday party I ever had. I mean, yeah, your friends. Yeah, are Jackie people. Robinson singing happy birthday to me. It was unbelievable. When he'd write to me, he would end his letters always, Jackie. Ron, thanks a lot. I appreciate the time. Dave, and it's a pleasure. Thank you. I love that he showed up to his birthday party. We have a link to Ron's website where you can order the book on care11.com slash Saturday.